when the moment you switch, put on a different hat and switch from just being a doer of what business you're in to the marketer of what you're doing. Not just I'm in the mortgage business, no, in the marketing business, but happens to be mortgage, in the marketing business, but whatever you say happens to be coaching. So is ask yourself on a day-to-day -day basis, how much time you're spending on marketing what you do versus just doing what you do. For most of us, we're not spending enough time marketing what we do. Because we think, nah, I don't, I don't need that. The more marketing you do, the less selling you have to do. The more marketing you do, the less selling you have to do. Because by the time someone, they come to you and they want to do business with you, if you've done your marketing properly, they just want, they just want to do business with you. There's not much selling. Because it's like your partner, when someone seeks him out, they already know I want to do business with him, right? He doesn't have to sit down, well, let's do coffee. Let me convince you why I'm so good. No, right? He's already, because the marketing he's been doing for many years, it works. So from there, then when they're happy that they got to get in touch with him, right? And say, yeah, now I have time for you and let's do some business. So spend a majority of time thinking about marketing, not just doing whatever you're doing. Uh, see yourself as, as a marketer of what you're doing. That little mind shift will, shift, will change your income. Just a little mind shift and say, you know what? What am I focusing on? What am I doing every day to get marketing my business? And I'm not just talking about going to networking and getting it out there. I'm talking like, what, what am I doing? Am I implementing some systems in place that would attract a, a, a consistent flow of clients? Does that make sense? Yes, Lee? Yes. Yes, good question. Very good question. There's so many other marketers you could hire, but again, you should be the best marketer for your business because no one cares about your business more than you do and no one knows your business more than you do. So I'm the best marketer for my, what I do. I'm the most passionate. Yes. I'm the most invested. Yes. Yes, and marketing, don't be, so, Lee, don't be so afraid. Marketing is not like, oh, I'm a good marketer, I'm not a good marketer. Marketing is actually quite formulaic and quite systematic. Marketing is not like people, have you ever have watched uh, the show Mad Men? Mad Men. Nobody? Nobody watches TV here? What's going on? No, okay, anyway, marketing, people say, oh, marketing, is it a whole bunch of guys sitting in the boardroom smoking weeds and coming up with ideas? That's not marketing. <laughs> like, it's not what it is. Okay, marketing is very, very systematic. There, there's, there's system, there are certain rules that you just follow and knowing you could use other people, but if you're a good marketer, I use other people. I use copywriter, I don't write copy anymore. I use uh, social media people, but I'm the best marketing guy for what I do, but because I am, I'm, being, I'm able more to better utilize them because they can't bullshit me. Like you said, well, you know, Dan, she charges 400 bucks an hour. Is, is it worth it? 400 a month. 400 a month, is it worth it? I don't know. But if you're a good marketer, you would know. You would know, okay, if, let's say I hire SEO company to do my search engine optimization. I know SEO. I just don't have the time to do it, but I would talk with them, I interview them. Hey, you know what? What are you gonna do to optimize for a website? Oh, I'm gonna do the, you know, the, the title tags and this and stuff. If I can sense, you guys don't know what the fuck you're talking about then I know then, then it's not a good company. But if they're talking about da 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 on, on page ranking, off page buildings and all this stuff, okay, you guys know what you're talking about. You guys are good, because I know what I'm talking about. Does that make sense? Yeah. So the better you are, the less you would be like taking advantage of, so you should know your stuff, but then you can delegate it. If you don't know it, then you don't know they're doing a good job or not. Then you would get frustrated because then you will spend the money, 400 bucks a month for three, four months, like, ah, oh, then I, maybe I'm not getting results, but you won't even know why you're not getting results. Are they not doing their job? Are they talking to the wrong people? Maybe the wrong media? Like, what, what is going on? But if you know the big picture strategy and you say, oh, do this and this and this and this, then you can adjust and correct. Does that make sense? Yeah. yeah. 10 times your finances, 10 times your business, 10 times your marketing, 10 times your life. Hit the subscribe button now.